for my last fight that I fought against the Silva in Glory 13, I clearly thought I won the fight and I was not the only one because the whole audience was surprised. I watched it back and I even believed that uh, the Silva was uh, was surprised. I don't think I lost the fight. I think it was a terrible mistake or the judges uh, were drunk. <laughs> when I was fighting Crow Cup in 2002, I didn't have any kids or family or my only goal was to be the best in the sport. By that time, uh, Crow Cup was already one of the big stars. So, and I was just a freshman. I was, uh, I was just a freshman. I, w I was already feeling good in this fight because I was putting a lot of pressure, but like the, his left high kick, I just made a mistake. I made a mistake. I caught, I caught his, I, w I thought I caught his, his foot, but he came up late. So he hit me when, I, when my hand was down. And that was his break to, to win the fight against me. I was really disappointed. I was really, really disappointed in this fight. Really disappointed. Because in your life you will get a couple of chances. Mm -hmm. Some people will get only one chance. And I got my first chance against Ray Seifo. That was my really first fight in, in Japan. I won that fight. And this was supposed to be, again, a break for me to, to make a step forward. And then I lost. I came back from that. Yeah. Okay. It made me stronger. Having uh, Mirko as a, as a friend, it doesn't make it harder to fight him. It does make it different to fight him. We don't call each other for the Christmas. We don't call each other for uh, for the New Year, etc. But I like Remy. Remy is a nice guy, you know, and. Uh, He's dedicated sportsman, uh, true warrior, and I respect him a lot. But uh, this is business, just like any other, you know. We've trained together, we've helped each other. But the moment that we step into the ring, we click on a button, and then we do what we have to do. Krokop is multi-talented, and he's strong. He knows how to defend himself, he knows how to attack. His best weapon, everybody knows his left, left kick and his hard punches. When you're getting older and older, you are losing your speed, but of course it's hard to measure. But uh, most important thing that I'm fast enough. That's most important for me. Yes, I know his weakest points, but he also will know my weakest points. Well, I wouldn't change my style completely. Maybe I use more clinching and uh, short distance now, but I think it's it, it is result of the so many fights in MMA, so maybe I change it a little bit, but not something dramatic. People know that I have a bad eye, people know that I've, I've been operating on my left leg, people know a lot of things. He always has his way of fighting, you know, with uh, his hands keeping up, a lot of knees, you know, low kicks. The most important thing will be who will be better prepared for the fight. Stamina will be the key of the success in this fight, definitely. Looking at my present career, I, I'm just thinking of winning one match and then looking to the other one, winning that match again. I will plan a future after the outcome of this fight. I, will, I won't regret for anything at the end of the day. You know, I have a long and rich career and uh, so what will happen, it will happen. I will be most proud of myself because uh, I was the self self-made fighter you know I started my in my old garage training myself training myself you know and uh, never had uh, some strong uh, camp or, 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 or big school you know, because there wasn't such a thing in, in my country. I think that the, the way to fight against Mercro would be put on a lot of pressure because if you let him come you will get stronger. This will be a war, definitely. I will, I will really give my best. I think it's gonna be a KO fight, yeah. It's uh, something special to fight in your hometown and uh, I think it is going to be a great show.